good to believe you when you never really answer questions and just dance around the topic. Um, well guys, I'm sorry. I mean, I, don't, I, I personally like don't really see how I'm... Bug. <laughs> I, I personally don't really see how I'm like dancing around a question. Um, I'm just kind of trying to tell you guys that like I'm okay. But, um, you know guys, I just kind of wish that you guys would understand that like sometimes it's like... Um, I just kind of feel like sometimes people keep like pushing me and people don't accept my answers or they just keep telling me like why I'm wrong. And sometimes like it starts making me like a little bit uncomfortable at times. And sometimes I may just not really want to answer every single question. And I just kind of wish people could understand that. Thanks queen of damage society blue. Oh my gosh, happy birthday to your grandma. That's amazing. I hope that your grandma has a super good birthday. You explained that so well, thank you. Um, I really, really don't want to sound rude like when I'm saying any of this, guys. And um, if it's coming off as rude or anything like that, I, I really am sorry. Um, but yeah, it's just like sometimes, like it's like I said, I just kind of feel like um, I'll try to answer something. And even when I answer, like I'm, I'm kind of scared of answering because I just know how the internet can be. Um, thank you, Respect small plant for the pits. They are not vocalized. Thank you. Yeah, because like, you know, guys, like honestly, sometimes I'm probably not like the best, I guess, at like boundaries, I guess. Um, and I will have a really hard time kind of like saying no to people or things like that. Um, like even when people do ask me questions, like I know some people really don't like my answers or they get upset with me. Um, but yeah, you know, like sometimes it's just like, it just gets a little uncomfortable when people keep pushing, I guess. I think they just see you've lost weight again, and if there is a reason why. Um, well, Dirk Riku, you know, I just kind of feel like also, like, when it comes to my weight and everything, like, I'm doing fine and everything, like, you know, there's nothing, like, bad going on with me right now or anything like that, like, I am taking care of myself and everything, like I've already said. Um, but I just kind of feel like, you know, like, my weight and, like, my body and everything is kind of like more my business than anything. Um, I just don't really feel like it's like other people's. Um, thank you, Yukini you fan forever. People who get upset with you for not answering are toxic. Thank you. And it's also like, you know, sometimes I think like people don't really understand. It's like when I was like away, people don't really know like everything that went on with me um, and how intense certain programs could have been and how effects on me, you know, that happened later and things like that. And it's like, you know, guys, like when I was away, a lot of stuff happened. Um, like, I don't always talk about like every single thing um, that, you know, has ever happened to me or everything that I've like, you know, not that I don't want to say like things I've gone through or like whatever, but it's like, sometimes like it's, it's scary even trying to answer questions, guys. Like, Maybe someday I'll be better at answering stuff and won't be like as scared, I don't know. But sometimes it can be kind of scary because like I said, um, sometimes people, I just feel like are so quick to kind of like put me down. Um, I feel like sometimes people really overanalyze everything and they say, they just say I'm gaslighting, they just say I'm a liar. Um, and maybe not everyone means to come off that way, but I'm not trying to not be a good example on me, but I'm also not trying to say like, oh, I'm the perfect role model, like whatever. Um, I'm just kind of trying to be the best person that I can be. And um, I think like, it doesn't mean I'm like a bad example, guys. Again, not to say like, oh, I'm the perfect role model. Everyone try to be like Eugenia. Everyone try to be like me. Um, but at the same time, it's like sometimes like when people just like, like, once again, I try to answer people's questions, but sometimes I just may not always want to answer, like, every single question. And um, I really do appreciate, like, everyone that, like, cares about me and everything like that. But, um, and I'm not trying to sound ungrateful. Like, I'm, I, again, I, I really appreciate everyone that, that genuinely does care. Um, but sometimes when, you know, I'm just kind of trying to stream or I'm just kind of trying to talk and it just kind of feels like people don't want to listen to me and they just keep pushing me and everything like that. It can kind of sometimes make me a little bit uncomfortable. And um, thanks, Eugenia Fan so Forever. To see you assertive. 
Thanks. I mean, I really hope that nothing I'm saying is like coming across as like rude right now. But um, I'm just kind of trying to explain. You are a terrible role model. I hope no kids look up to you, but unfortunately, I'm sure they do. Um, well, Remy, I I'm sorry that you feel that way about me and everything. Um, I'm not trying to say that I'm a role model. Um, I'm just a person, you know, I'm just a person like anyone else. Um, I it's not really my job here, guys, to like parent kids. And um, I always try to make that clear to people. Like, I, 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 I can't really parent everyone's kids for them. Uh, thank no, you, Skull Plant, for the bit. to enforce boundaries. Thank you. It's just like, I don't know. I really hope nothing I'm saying is coming across as rude. Like, I, I do feel bad if it does. But it's like, with some of you guys, see, that's the thing. It's like, I'm just trying to stream, and then I get people, like, coming in here, attacking me, just telling me, like, oh, you're a bad role model. Um, why do you still make online appearances? Because, guys, like, this is, like, what I do. You know, I'm really grateful for all the people that are kind to me. Um... I'm really, why am I looking to the side? Um, because I'm gonna play Genshin, like I've already said, and because I moved the screen to this monitor, so I'm now looking at a different monitor. It's not really a big deal, it's just kinda, yeah. Um, but, I don't know guys, it's just kinda, like I said, um, it's okay if you don't wanna talk about those things. I can understand that people are very confused because of your weight and appearance, but it's up to you to talk about it. Thanks, Cloud Lover, you know? Um, yeah, like, um, thanks, small plant for the bit. Enforcing boundaries isn't true. You are not a bad role model. You are a human who wants to play games and talk to her fan base. Thanks, and that's honestly all I'm trying to do, guys. Like, like I said, I'm really just a person. Um, I'm just kind of trying to be the best person I can. Like, I know that a lot of people, like, judge me over my appearance sometimes, like, what they think they know about me. Do you understand why we worry? Um, well, guys, listen, I, I see a lot of comments online and everything, and I know, like, a lot of people, like I've already said, um, will judge me or will have their thoughts about me because of, like, the way I look to them or whatever uh thank you you're for the bit model if i had a eugenia child, fan forever a heart of gold like you oh you're so sweet eugenia fan forever well thank you i really really appreciate it um but you know guys it's like i'm i'm just kind of like constantly seeing um messages some nice which i always appreciate but some not so nice and i understand that like some of you guys care and i really do appreciate that um, but at the same time, it's like, you know, um, I'm, I'm just kind of like, uh, thank you, Alyssa, for the bit. It's not true that all people are so disrespectful and want answers to everything, but then get mad at your answer. Exactly. They trolls and they clearly have no life at all. People need help themselves because it's not normal to be this obsessed. People genuinely suck so badly sometimes. <sighs> Yeah, it's like, um, no, guys, I'm not saying worried people are trolls. Uh, I didn't say that. Once again, I, I am saying that I, I, I'm, I'm very appreciative towards people that, that care about me. Um, like, I see some of you guys already being like, worried people are not all trolls, WTF. I, I'm not saying that. Once again, there are some trolls in here, guys. There are. There are some people that are literally probably in here just because they want to get a video. Um... I'm not saying every single person. I'm, I'm, that's not what I'm saying. But it's like, um, I wish you guys would understand. There, I, I just, like, I, I don't know. I just feel like no one wants to listen. Um, oh my God, you know the difference. And I'm tired of people acting like you don't. Thank you, James. I mean, that's the thing, guys. It's like some of you guys, see, and then it comes down to yes or no. Do you understand why people are worried? Like, why does everything have to be just like a yes or no? I don't really like. I think some people have thanks, been Eugenia, fan forever for the bit. They are toxic and hide it by calling it concern when you repeatedly say it violates your boundaries. Thank you, because it's like I'm kind of trying to say that nicely, but I just feel like no one wants to listen to me. Um, I yeah, I just feel like people are putting words in my mouth right now. Thank you, Maddie Blue, for the bit. He's been in recovery for seven years. The way people act around this subject is extremely incorrect and it does not help regardless of your current situations. Ed was the hardest thing I've ever been though and it consumes your mind in a way these people cannot understand. You're 100 in your right to assert boundaries. 
Thank you so much, Maddie. Um, I really, really, really appreciate you saying that. I'm so, so sorry about what you've been through. And um, I don't know, guys. I just kind of feel, I'm sorry if this isn't some people's intention in here, but I do kind of feel like some of you guys are kind of twisting my words a bit. Um, I also don't personally really see why everything has to be a flat out yes or no. Because I feel like if I say yes, then people are gonna be like, well then why don't you address what people are worried about? Why don't you do this or that? Why are you this way? Like, oh, so you're admitting you're not okay, so this or that? So that's why I don't wanna say yes. But then if I feel like if I say no, then people are gonna be like, oh, she's gaslighting, she sees our comment. It's like, that's why like, I, I, I don't, I, I, like it's, I wish people sometimes would just not be like, get mad at me for not just saying like yes or no. Cause yeah, I, I kind of do feel like it's like a trap for me. Um, I kind of feel like, it's just how I feel. Like, I'm sorry if like anyone feels that like my feelings are wrong or whatever, but I, I just kind of feel like it's a lose-lose situation. Exactly, thanks for all toxin. That's how I feel. I just kind of feel like it puts me in like a lose-lose situation. I feel like either way with like, no matter what I say, it, it's just how it feels to me guys. Um, it just feels like I can't win. And um, I just kind of wish like sometimes people would understand on the internet. It doesn't mean that, oh, thank you. Uh, Whippolette, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Le Love Kitty Mobile. Thank you, Silk Spectre, for the bitch. can't respect your boundaries. It is not their business. Thanks. You have the right to keep your personal life private and keep things to yourself. You don't owe anyone anything. You are loved. Please never forget that. Heart, Thanks, Silk Spectre. It seriously really, really means a lot. So thank you so much. Um, I'm really, really grateful towards you guys that, like, are understanding. Um, because, like, you know, guys, like, with none of this am I trying to be hateful or anything. Um, thank you for the pit small plant. Sweetheart. Thank you. Um, I appreciate that small plant a lot because, like, sometimes I just feel like I literally can't talk without people saying I'm playing victim or just like saying I'm gaslighting or getting mad about whatever I say. And then, I don't know, then it's just like, um, thank you for the bits yes, again, small plant. For how you feel. Thank you, I appreciate it because it's like, sometimes like I kind of question how I feel because I just feel like I'm just like, I don't know, like people are just kind of constantly getting upset with me. Um, and like, it's just kind of like, Thank you, Ladex, for the dollar donation. Thank you. My um, oh, and, and thank you, Ladex, but you know, don't worry about that. Like again, um, I, I really do appreciate people that care about me and everything. But um I I I, I, I if I felt like I was gonna pass out, like I wouldn't be here streaming. Um I definitely don't feel like I'm gonna pass out or anything like that, and I am taking care of myself. All right, um, so Alyssa, thank you for the bits. Concern doesn't mean attacking you every stream and constantly invading your privacy. Thank you, also Alyssa. How bad of a person someone is literally is the exact opposite of concern. Yeah, because thank you also for saying that because um, that's like a whole other thing of like people just telling me what a bad person I am. And saying all this stuff like that, that makes me feel really bad. Thanks, Eugenia Fan Forever for the fits. And thank you. Um, I'm so thankful for you guys that, like, genuinely, you know, care about me and listen. And just, like, you know, don't kind of keep pushing me and attacking me and things like that. And, yeah, you know, guys, like, first of all, um, I know not everyone is like that. Um, I'm not trying to say it's, like, every single person like that. Thank you, Small Planet, for the bits. <laughs> yeah, we should probably start playing a little bit of Genshin. I don't know. I at least want to try to do dailies. Honestly, guys, I don't think I'm going to stream much longer. It's like 1.23 a.m., so it's getting pretty late. So I don't think I'm going to play for very long, but I'll play for a little bit. Maybe I'll just, like, do dailies and try to do one of those challenges, exactly. maybe. Go up to Thanks, Maddie, for the bits. And harass them like this. Eds are something that happens in your inner world and you suffer immensely when you have it. So how is it okay to barrage someone about something that's so personal? You will never be a bad person for having mental illness. Honestly, the lack of education on this topic is dangerous. Thanks, Maddie Blue. Yeah, thank you, Sushi Thanks, Gremlin, for the bits. 101 is accept your patient and be non-judgmental. The hate online is just hate and harassment. Love you. Hope Thank you. I really, really appreciate everything that you guys are saying because it's like, 
Um, now, don't get me wrong, guys. Like, I, I know some of you guys, like, probably have, like, you know, good intentions and everything like that. And, um, you know, like I said, I, I'm seriously, I'm grateful to everyone that cares about me and supports me and everything. But it's just, like, sometimes when people are pressuring me and, like, acting like this way towards me, I just don't really find it... <sighs> Mitchie! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Thank you for gifting 50 subs! That is insane! I'm so grateful, Mitchie! You are so sweet! Thank you! Wow! Oh my gosh, Mitchie! Mitchie, you have been so sweet tonight! Thank you! You are amazing, Mitchie! I'm so thankful! Don't take the time to think Thank about you, Violin Violin Spirit of Sids! No matter whatever you are going through at any time, being bombarded isn't helpful. Thank they you. Take a couple seconds to put themselves in your shoes, they may reevaluate their actions. Yeah, it's and just, just kind of like the difference between a comment of concern and a rude comment. Yeah, it's just kind of like bombarding me sometimes. It just kind of makes me kicking mojo in Genshin. Well, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Eugenia I fan forever for the bits. So I know what it's like to be hounded about your way to. I'm so sorry. Yeah, people sometimes, it's like, oh my gosh. Thank you, Violin Violin, for gifting a sub to Small Plant. I appreciate it so much. And thank you, Snow Bunny Monster, hey, for four months. Love hey. Always. Looking beautiful as always. Aw, you're so sweet, Snowy Bunny Monster. Thank you. Um, Oh my gosh. And thank you again, Mitchie. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy that so many more people can now be subscribers that's so amazing <laughs> i was not expecting that tonight so oh my gosh thank you oh this is like so many new subs today mitchy <laughs> thank you thank you thank you to everyone that's been so kind tonight though guys i i really really appreciate it you are a wonderful person thanks ruby web you're a great person too thank you thank you so much you are precious and amazing, Eugenia. Don't let others tell you otherwise. Thanks, Eugenia Fan Forever. It means a lot. It's like, I don't know. Like, I feel bad sometimes because it's like, I just feel like, I don't know, like the way people can be. It's just like, I just feel like I can, like, I know it's impossible, honestly, to make everyone happy. Like, it's just kind of really not possible for me to do that. But I don't know. It's just like, sometimes I just feel like people just are so quick to get like so upset. And yes, Jeffrey, thank, thank you for the bits. To those haters and thank you, yeah, we'll play a little bit again, Shin. We'll we'll do a little bit. Wait, is there any more mail? My gosh, I can't believe that um the update for Genshin is coming so soon. It's so crazy. I gotta go back to controller, guys, because I had my controller unplugged. So I need to go back to controller for now. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh, that's so many new subs. I'm so happy so many more of you guys can be subscribers now. That's so crazy. Make yourself happy and your fans will be happy too. Oh, well, thank you. It's like, you know, it's like I always do want to make people happy and stuff, but it's like, sometimes I think that kind of applies to anyone. It's like, you also have to just like do what makes you happy because you never can really make everyone happy. Uh, thank you, Nova Night Owl, so much for the 200 bits. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you. Um, you want to sub? Uh -huh. Well, I mean, if you do end up subbing, then thank you so much. Um, like, if you have Prime, too, you might be able to sub for free, actually. Um, if, if like, that's a way for anyone to sub. If you guys didn't know. Thank you, James, for posting that link. You guys can click on that link if you happen to have Amazon Prime. And then when you guys click there, um, basically, oh, thank you, Mary Me, Eugenia, you for the bit. You're able to make everyone happy, but you make me happy. And well, I greatly thank appreciate you. It. I mean, I'm happy I can make any of you guys happy. It's like, I know. I know there's a lot of people online that get upset with me and, you know, find a lot of issues with me and just like whatever. But I mean,. I don't know. It's like, it kind of is just like impossible. Violent Violence! <laughs> Thank you so much for gifting a sub to No Pomegranates. 
No pomegranates. I'm really happy you can be a sub now. Thank you so much. Thanks for the 12 bits, small plant. Heck, the hates. Yeah. I mean, I think you just have to try to, I, I try to not let the negativity get to me. And it's like, I also know that, like, I'm sure a lot of you guys don't mean bad. And don't get me wrong. I really do appreciate everyone that cares about me. But I just kind of wish, like, sometimes people would understand that, like, sometimes when people kind of, like, are the way they are, and they just keep telling me why I'm wrong, and they just kind of keep pushing me, and, like, things like that, and trying to make me answer questions even if I don't want to answer them, or just kind of be in the way they can be, you know? Then it's, I don't really think it's really that helpful towards, like, anybody really like in my opinion and um i don't know it's just kind of wish i, I just kind of wish like sometimes people would just kind of like relax and, and just not be like so quick to just call me a liar and like get upset with me and like i know they're allowed to like have their opinions and everything but it's just kind of just kind of how i feel sometimes i guess i don't know but yeah